Hi guys, uh, I'm uploading this video specially for the match I just seen. It was a cricket match, Pakistan Super League, and uh, what a performance! I was supporting both teams. Uh, I was supporting Quetta Gladiators and Peshawar Zalmay, uh, but uh, the finish and it was looked like a India Pakistan match, and I was just so much into it, like you didn't know the last ball like who gonna win and then after that the celebration and and people crying and it, it was <clears throat> it was amazing and um, I would love like I would like to congratulate uh, Quetta Gladiators the way they performed in a very very tense situation and uh, of course Peshawar Zalmay played really good uh, just in the last, it was a, s a small uh, total game, like it wasn't a, a quite big score, it was um, a low scoring game, but still the way um, Quetta held their nerve, um, I think maybe, maybe, um, I would say, um, Sammy, he had enough run in, in that over, Darren Sammy, and there wasn't any need. I know when you're in a thrill and you wanted to hit and you quite sure it's gonna go over the boundary line, but it wasn't the case and Nathan McCullum didn't um, like, you know, miss that chance and he caught the uh, ball. And uh, after that, uh, I think it was kind of impossible. Then Wahab Riyas hit, hit um, a boundary four runs and then it was just Again, Peshawar Zalmi might win it, but I would say uh, doesn't matter. Uh, Peshawar Zalmi may go another chance, which they will probably uh, perform really good. And they need to see who's going to win tomorrow's match. You, uh, United, uh, Istanbul United versus Karachi Kings, and um, and especially I would like to say uh, Sir Vivian Richard, the way he was jumping and. And then after the match, the way um, the Sir Fraud just running and then and he just kind of tripped on, like there was a guy who was just running uh, um, into him and he just jumped and just lay on the floor and Moin Khan came and it was just happiness and the people crying and emotions and happiness and uh, Afridi daughters like praying and it was look like like something like it's an India Pakistan game, and you like were waiting for. Of course, the both Pakistani teams, but it was a it was a amazing to watch, and uh, I'm I'm so so much happy um, here in UK. Uh, like we watching, and then we can say like uh, uh, something we like own the Pakistan Super League is our league and. We are uh, really happy that this uh, tournament is taking place at the moment in um, UAE, Dubai, in Sharjah, and hopefully, inshallah, very, very, very soon in Pakistan, uh, where the crowd will be more, especially today was a house full. So, thank you, uh, Pakistan. Thank you, Pakistan Super League. Thank you, the, uh, the crowd who were there. Thank you, the commentators, Ramiz Raja, like you name every single person, uh, Tom Moody and Bazid Khan and and the uh, loads of other people. Thank you for the the staff, the ground staff, and the, the event organizers and every single person who is uh, uh, um, like you know organizing this uh, big event and i would like to say thank you so much and let's see who's gonna win united versus um kings uh karachi kings um i have a very big doubt the way quite a gladiator played well done no doubt but i have a i have a doubt that uh, maybe uh islamabad united will win the title I don't know why, I'm just like thinking. The way Quetta played today, there's no way anyone can stop them. But I have a feeling that Quetta, uh, sorry, uh, Islamabad United will win the title. Because 
some of us, you know, have not been in the news, nowhere, anywhere like this. They were just like kind of a side where kind of no one knows about them, right? You know, in a way on a side, but don't forget Wasim Akram, who can, like, he have to mention Wasim Bhai and he's there and uh, the way he is. So it's going to be a really, really tough ask. But let's see uh, to beat uh, Quarter Gladiator in the final. And they have to beat in Karachi tomorrow. And uh, they have to beat uh, Peshawar Zalmay. Let's see. Um, I'm myself, I'm from Karachi. I'm, I've been supporting Karachi Kings. And uh, I'm really kind of disappointed. Uh, the amount of money um, was involved. And uh, for Karachi, the highest kind of... Uh, the Sulman Agba paid lot, uh, a lot of money for uh, the team, but they didn't perform well. It was a quite nice and balanced team, but I don't know what happened to them. But anyway, today I don't want to talk about Karachi. I have spoken about them a lot. What I want to do, I want to enjoy. I want to chill out because Koira won the game. And the way they played the game was amazing. So please, please, guys. Uh, watch uh, my channel. I have plenty of videos. I'm gonna be bringing more videos in regarding to United and Karachi match. If I'm at United and Karachi, then after that, whoever win tomorrow, they're gonna play Peshawar Zalme. I'm gonna do a little review on that as well. And uh, that's it. But it was a uh, for today's match. Afridi should have stayed on, but. The way he just like, you know, given in the hand and gone. And so I would say the, the main, from there the turning point come is when the bear store got a uh, bowl. And uh, the another uh, thing was Sammy. Sammy, there wasn't any, any need for you to hit that. Like you already scored enough runs in that over. And at the end of the day, you know, like, batting against some Mickey Mouse. I know you hit him six and, and stuff like that, but still, it's a <clears throat> tournament best bowler at the moment. So you're hitting him, you like, you know, it's not Christmas every day, but anyway, it's fine. But I was a little bit, because I was saying like, okay, Darren Sammy, I like him, the way he plays and stuff. I said they're going to take him, he's going to take them like home, but no. But anyway, I'm really happy for Quetta Gladiators, and uh, well done. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Bye-bye.